Hey YouTube, what's up? Since I'm showing you guys some of the stuff we're going to be using this semester, I thought I'd show you guys some um, other things that we got. Um, one is the Scratch Pico Board. I'm trying to show this around. Okay, so a Pico Board is a sensor board that you use with um, using Scratch. And I like it because Scratch is such a great first programming language to work with, especially if you have younger kids that are interested in programming. Like um, my twins are, they're, they're eight. Um, so they're, they're on the young side, um, to start programming. And so Scratch was just a really great fit. And with this board, it really helps you to like expand the stuff that they can do with it. So here's, um, how the board looks. Okay. And then there's the various, um, sensory inputs that come in there. The board is really easy to read. And I really like this one because it's color coordinated. So it will be very clear with what they have to do with the board and you know what they're connecting to to what and so it's really good not only is it a functional board but it's really good as a training board and it also comes with these um like little leds and your alligator clips are there and also your um cables for connections and um ours came with this little um a very great instruction manual that's yeah like all in like mandarin so yeah that no <laughs> that won't help us um but uh you can get these various places off of amazon and different things like that but if you have a kid especially um a younger kid but anybody um if you have somebody who's learning scratch and they want to start doing things outside of just um, the Scratch program and using that programming, those programming skills that they're learning to do some other stuff beyond that. Um, this is a good Pico board. When the twins actually use and build some stuff with it, uh, they'll be put that on their channel that you guys know if some things come up there that they they're doing they kind of choose what they put up there so sometimes they they work with stuff and they use stuff and they don't put it on their channel so i can't guarantee that you guys are going to be able to see it in action but the board itself is extremely well well built and it is a great kind of transition from okay now i know how to program in scratch what do i use this for this is a great way for them to start transitioning their learning to some real things so hope this helps